trying to kill that stupid egger there. What? <laughs> Why are they attacking the tree? Oh man. Brainworms, man. Brainworms. Welcome back, everybody, to 70s. And I'm an old guy gaming, and it is Horde Night. We have one hour left before the Horde Night starts. Uh, so I mined up a little bit of iron and uh, got some iron ingots forged. Did a couple more things on the base, the Horde base, including uh, putting some wood frames around uh, the part I'm going to stand on. So that way, um, if, in case we do get spiders, which we could on Horde 7, they can't climb up and get us. So. Uh, let's see before we before we hop up there. I got to do a couple more things in here So we got those bars upgraded And what I'm gonna do is just separate these like so And see I can upgrade four more sets to iron um, You know what I might end up doing though we should probably save some iron for repairing the the bar that's the most important, which is the one by us. So probably what we'll do is let's see. So we've got 23. Let's do this bottom one here, but we're gonna save the rest of our iron ingots. We'll save the rest of those. Okay, let's get the second block up, upgraded to cobble. Cause that's the one that's gonna uh, get take the most hits from the Zika Ruskies. All right, that's done. Now um, let's go ahead and jump up here. Now pull this one up, and then put that one in place. And if you know if the shed hits the fan, we bail off and jump on the mini bike, and then take our chances. Um, but th apparently the game will spawn in buzzards when you do that. So let's put a couple of torches there. We're not going to be able to see in there really well, but we'll have to do. Um, and then let's see, I've got this one to upgrade as well. Okay, so both of the hatches are completely upgraded as far as they can go and without you know bringing them to steel. And so the plan's going to be that we're just basically going to shoot um, our rifle, we've got 312 rounds of 7.62, so this is going to be our main weapon. If we run out of 7.62s, well, we've got 18 blunders, and then we still have 69 crossbows, a uh, bull crossbow bolts after that. When they get close enough to, you know, they, these bars here, we can also, you know, chuck some Molotovs um, and maybe even some pipe bombs in there too. But we'll have to wait till they break through and get that far. I probably won't worry about repairing these bars since we have a, a very small amount of forged iron, but this is the one, excuse me, that we'll work on uh, repairing. The other thing I was thinking about, too, is we are out of time pretty much, but what if we were to take this and turn that into that and then do a copy rotation, um, but then flip it around... Oh, shit. Of course you went the way the way that I didn't want you to go. Yeah, that's not going to work. Um, oh, well. Well, whatever. It is what it is. It's showtime. Let's get that down there and start shooting. One bad thing about this weapon is you can't really shoot it from the hip because the spread is really bad. So we're just going to have to aim and take our time and get some headshots in. All right, we got another level. That's good. That means we can build our workbench next. Try and make as many shots count as we can. We've got a decent amount of ammo, but we don't have an unlimited amount of ammo. They are kind of hitting on the side, which is interesting.
Oh, how the hell did you get up there? What? Oh, you know what I forgot to do? Shit, I forgot to, to block the front end. That's right, damn it. Okay. Um, usually you put a little bit of an ogre overhang on the front end too. So that way they can't jump up on their each other's shoulder. I go, oh shit, I gotta be careful here. No, 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 wrong, wrong thing, this one. That one especially is important, but we do want to get these ones upgraded too. Just didn't have enough time to get it all done. Story of my life, right? Okay, that should prevent them from being able to jump up on top there. Okay, let's get back at it. So they're kind of going off to the side. You know what I think? I think their AI's thinking is that they can find another, another path to me. So yeah, I should have thought about that. So here's what we're gonna do. Uh, we need to break this block so they don't think there's a path there. Oh, for goodness sakes. Take a coffee. I kind of put those, these blocks in here at the last second and... I should have known better from our experience in the uh, experimental that that wasn't a good idea. Okay. I don't think they'll see this as a path anymore, but let's just remove this one too. And then we're going to have to do the same thing on the other side too. So yeah, that was my bad. Okay. And then what we'll do is we'll just put those there to block block that okay and then let's get let's just put that there and we got to get these other ones out quick and then the, then they'll try and come back down the middle again I'm glad I didn't actually get these upgraded to cobblestone <laughs> that would have been bad Oh, stamina. Wonder why they're still trying to go that way. Hmm, interesting. Well, they're not going to get over here if they continue going that way. It's not going to happen. This will at least prevent them from, um, you know, trying to jump over. I might even bring this one all the way up to cobble. Okay. Let's see if we can start getting back to shooting here. They're still fixated on that side. All right, well here, let's um do this then at least. I, I have no skill in um, sharpshooter, so it's not helping any <laughs> as far as the, the spread goes and all that their AI still thinks there's a pathway to me um, on that side okay well that's 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 better yeah just come back down the center now don't be um trying to break through on that side now here, let's get this upgraded too, just in case they do try to do that. Remember, if they actually break all the way through here, I can still pull those trapdoors up. Of course, then they'll start, you know, trying to break uh, the base that I'm on. And who knows how long that'll hold up, but it'll buy us a little more time anyway. Kill that stupid Edgar there. What? <laughs> they attacking the tree? Oh man. Brainworms, man. Brainworms. I cannot reach them from here.
It's interesting, when I upgraded these to cobble, then they went back to the other side, but they're not coming through the middle. There, now I can get to their heads. As long as they stay a little closer, too, then I don't have to worry about the spread as much. There you go, Big Mama. Nope, stand right there. Okay, let's do a little repair on... Oh, they're not even hitting that. They're just kind of getting hung up on that other block. Are they still hitting the tree over there? That's so funny. Guys are so dumb! <laughs> I think Ronald McDonald just bailed off the side again. Can't quite get to their heads. Sometimes I can, but... Down again. Okay. All right. I think we killed the horde. Well, that didn't go the way I had planned it, but I mean, it. it <laughs> we survived. We survived at least, and we almost went up another level. So yeah, I think the problem was that I just I had a pathway for them, and the AI saw that and it started working towards it because it figured. I mean, it's still kind of silly for them to do that because it's going to be a lot harder for them to break through, I don't know, what is that, 8? And then, you know, times 2, so 16-ish flagstone blocks instead of just one, or, or I mean two, iron bars. You'd think that they'd still go for the bars because that's still going to be easier than breaking through that many blocks, but apparently it doesn't work that way. So, all right, well, um, if we use this design again... I might go ahead and remove another two blocks that way, just so there can be no doubt at all in the AI's quote-unquote mind that there's a pathway that they can come through there. And that should force them then to stay down the middle again. I mean, I don't know. We'll see. I'm not even sure I'm going to use this the next time around, though, either. So we'll have to just kind of see how that goes. Nevertheless, we did survive the Horde Night. Um, in fact, it's only like 1.30 in the morning, or 12.30 in the morning, so... Uh, yeah, we, we definitely took them out. Okay, so we have one point, and that point is going to go right on into Advanced Engineering to Tinkerer, so we can make our own workbench, and then we'll have our forge and our workbench in the house. The next thing we'll probably do is take interns so we can build the chemistry station, and then that will pretty much get us all of our main crafting stations. And once that's done, then, then we're going to switch back over to, I don't know, uh, we'll switch back over to something else and start working on, you know, maybe more strength, uh, including sexy T. We should probably at least put one point in there. I want to get, you know, the mining skills up a little more um, and probably boom stick because we're going to be coming across a shotgun here really quick and, and probably a couple more points to skull crusher. That's the general plan for now. Anyway, guys, that's it for the rest of this Horde Night. Um, let's go ahead and pick up our torch. Like I said, I'll think about whether or not I want to give this one more try on, like, night 14. Um, and maybe, you know, by then we'll have the ability to, um, you know, make uh, concrete, too, uh, so we can make it a lot stronger. So we'll just have to see how that goes. Oh, we got a bag. Nice. Let's get this back down here. We need to repair this, too. It's very close. All right, what do we have here? <laughs> Shit. Okay, well, it's no no better than what we have, so we'll just scrap it. Come on, man. We are we're in freaking tier one now. We're out of tier zero. So I wish the game would start giving me the tier zero or the tier one stuff. A little frustrating, but whatever. Well, what do we do for the rest of the night? We do have a quest over there that we got to do. I'm really low on foods, too, so I wonder if we maybe ought to not go do a little bit of hunting. Uh, get a little... Well, I've actually got a fairly decent amount of meat. We just might need to make up a bunch of grilled meat. So, 
Yeah, we've got actually we've got quite a bit of meat. So I think that's what we'll do because I'm I'm really low on on canned food. I got this one thing of spam left, but we're still down quite a bit on food. So yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll probably just make some grilled meat. So how many in total can we make? Twenty-two. We're not gonna make that many. Uh, let's make ten. So we'll get that going. Um, I think. Yeah, there's not really enough iron in here to to do too much more with that. We can make a few more bullet casings, of course. So let's get those going. And I'm just gonna put. We don't. We no longer need to carry, you know, flagstone blocks with us. Um, you know, for platforms, because now that we have the mini bike, uh, so let's just stick these. I don't know where do we want to put these. Let's put them up here, I guess. So we're good to go on that. Uh, Gunpowder, something we need, of course. Lots of stuff that we need. Lots of stuff that we need. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's do. Um, I think I'm gonna wait for that meat to finish, and then I'll meet you guys over at our our quest location and we will we'll do that quest okay so I'll see you guys over there all right guys I'm back um, I had to uh, log out and go do something in real life and I completely forgot that if you log out uh, when horde night's not over um, it spawns in a new horde so now I'm trying to fight these guys um, in my house here <laughs> and hold them off until morning we got about 49 more in-game minutes uh, to do this and they're also trying to get at me from other places besides just here um so we got a couple of dudes out here too let's um let's get this uh, reinforced here So yeah, I, I, I know I know that that happens, I just didn't think about it because, you know, like I said, I had to go do some stuff in real life and I came back and then all of a sudden, I logged back in and then all of a sudden I got rushed. <laughs> so, um, okay, so let's see if we can uh, do some more damage here. have too much more time to go. If we can just hold out until morning, then we'll be all right. Oh my god, this is crazy. Whoop. No, 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 no. Don't go down there. Let's get this upgraded here, too. As long as I can kind of keep them in the area I'm in and they're not trying to break in through other places at the same time, we could potentially make this work. Uh, here, we gotta go quickly, grab some more of this and this, so we can make some more cobble. Oh, here we go. Uh, yeah, just make whatever. I don't care right now. <laughs> I just gotta survive. Are you trying to break in? Oh, shit. Don't be breaking in on this side, dummies. Well, actually, they're being smart. Let's get the, at least the second block up. Oh, shit. Not good. Now what's the matter? Oh, okay. That wants iron. Fuck me, man. All right, here. All right, here. Let's try this. Let's... Yeah, we'll keep that like it is, I suppose. Can I get back to some of them from over here? Come over here. Stay away from over there. I'll tell you what, if they do happen to break through there, let's at least block that off so they don't surprise us immediately. If we do survive this, the good news is we're getting a lot more XP. Okay, so that's done. Still trying to work on that in there. Okay, he's dead. Let's get this upgraded. The things I get myself into, man, I'll tell you what.
Okay, is anybody over here? I think we're okay over there for the moment. I'm I'm worried about what's going on in here. Oh, phew, okay. So we won't get any new ones. Let's get this upgraded. See, that wants iron. The, uh, I guess they can't quite get to that one, can they? Okay. Problem is I can't shoot them from this side because... Uh, you know, because the door is in the way. Okay, I think we're okay over there. Um, alright, let's go back in here. Oh, what I think I'm gonna do is break this out. Let's reinforce this again. And then we'll just take them out at the knees. Hey, don't you crawl in here, lady. Get that upgraded there. Edgar, you got some tough-ass knees, man, I'm telling you. Some tough-ass knees. Holy shit, they keep coming. We're gonna shoot up all of our 7.62s, but hey, that's what it takes to survive. That's what it takes to survive. Phew, this is intense. Okay, now, where in the hell are you guys coming from now? Oh, shit. Okay, here. I got a little something for you guys. Um, here, let's grab these, and let's also grab these, too. There you go. And then we got a few friends over here. Let's just throw those out there. It's almost like they keep spawning them or something. We are almost out of 7.62s. Okay, you guys are still burning. That's good. Looks like we killed all of you? Most of you? Okay. Okay, she's down. Whew, okay. I mean, and I, <laughs> I had actually killed quite a few more before I even started the camera. I mean, I wasn't even thinking about starting the camera. I was thinking about, oh, shit, <laughs> I gotta survive this. Uh, I think we're okay. We got one more Zikaru out there. That guy's just wandering off. Oh, man, that was nuts. Yeah, uh, boys and girls, do not log off when Horde Night is still going on, because if you do... You get a new horde when you log back in. Completely space that off. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, like I said, silver lining, we got a bunch more XP. In fact, almost another whole level, in fact. Um, almost, no, excuse me, almost two more. Well, we were almost to the next level at the end of the first horde night, and now I got another almost level, so... Can't complain about that. Can't complain about that. So we're actually going to take this level um, and we're going to put that into position so we can also make our chemistry station. But we have to come up with a beaker first, of course, before we can do that. Oh, man. It's kind of a bummer that we shot up all of our 762s. But, I mean, you know, we ha didn't have much choice. We had, to, we had to survive. So at the end of the day, it was put to good use. Let's get these guys reloaded. Uh, I wonder if the trader has uh, more 762s. Here, let's stop that. <laughs> Don't need to keep making that shit. Um, okay, we'll put that back. That stuff back. Alright, so what happens is they actually get kind of stuck on the railing out there, which is fine with me. I mean, it kind of works in our favor when that happens. Oh, man. Okay, so... 
Let's see if we can deal with this guy the old-fashioned way. Ah, he's gonna get stuck over there. Shit. Okay. I want to save the last 762s we have for dire emergencies. So let's see if we can kill this guy with our crossbow, I guess. Whoops. Kind of hard to hit him. There we go. Headshot. We just don't have any enough skill to do much about it. There we go. Okay, so we took care of him. What we're going to do here is we're going to um, break this block. And then we'll go outside the door and then we'll just blast the guy stuck up on the rail. Then I think we're finally free and clear. Oh man, that was nuts. Uh, do we have any coffee? Yes, we do. Edgar? I still didn't kill him. There's our next level. Look at us and our bad selves. Oh, we got a bag, too. <laughs> That's the same shit we got in the last bag. You stupid game. Oh, man. That's bullshit. Whew. Okay. So, yeah, they popped a hole in the wall over there. Um, let's patch that up with some of this. And I'm going to have to break that out of the way again, too. What I was going to do when I came back on was I was going to go mine up a little more iron so I could make my workbench. And to do that, I need to make a hammer um, first, and then I still need enough iron to make the actual workbench itself. Um, but, of course, that didn't work out so well, did it? I'll break that later. I would like to see if Trader Joel has some... Uh, has a, a beaker. I wasn't really paying attention to that because I wasn't looking for one before. Let's keep these rails actually repaired because they, they actually help us out. So let's grab our, our money. I'm going to sell that too. I want to see if he's got um, a beaker and I want to see if he has any 762s. So let's check that out and then we're going to wrap up this episode. And what I'm going to do in between episodes is I'm going to mine up some more iron because I'm going to need that, you know, for the workbench, the hammer that I need, and the workbench. Um, and if he has a beaker, I'll also work on the chemistry station. Let's take a look and see. No, if he had one, I think it would probably be under science or chemicals, probably. Let's look in here, though. Yeah, shit, I don't see one in here either. And nothing comes up if we do a search. Okay, well, we're just going to have to wait for his inventory to reset or luck out and find one at some point uh, before we can do the um, the chem bench. So in the meantime, <clears throat> you know, we'll have to just make gunpowder in our own inventory, which takes twice the resources, but what can you do, right? Uh, the other thing we wanted to look at is see if he had any 762s. So he doesn't in secret stash. He's got some armor piercing. Hmm. It's kind of expensive. How much would it cost to buy all of those? 1987. Does he have any gunpowder? He doesn't. Well, I'll tell you what. I mean, these are kind of expensive for us, but if it means it's going to save our life, it's money well are spent. We done here. So let's load up the those. Um, all right, so, yeah, guys, I think that's it for this episode. What I will do, like I said, is I'm going to work on uh, mining some iron, and let's buy any, let's buy some eye candy and some miso. So, yeah, I'll work on mining some iron and get, get the work, at least get the workbench um, built, and then when I'm finished with that, we'll probably go ahead and 
start the next episode. But I'll meet you, I'll probably meet you at the questing location for that. Excuse me, sir, coming through. So, yeah, that's it. Guys, have a great rest of your day, morning, afternoon, evening. I don't even know why the hell I'm saying that. <laughs> but hey, I mean it, though. Have a, have a good day. And I uh, <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, uh, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.